hello i'm back so right now i'm going to be explaining about how the oneness of god has essentially helped me uh, develop a very successful business and to keep the discipline to keep at it now the oneness of god entails the fact that allah is the one and true god so of course in the past like such as the greek times you had uh, zeus you had mars you have athena all these uh, gods which um, essentially all had different characteristics like mars was the war of god and venus was the war of i mean god the goddess of fertility and beauty now us muslim we believe that uh, allah is one and only so everything that happens around us is all because of allah like for example all of this water flowing my life and everything that happens to us and everything that happened to us and everything that will happen to us is because of god now of course this uh, islam is the true monotheist uh, religion in itself because it's the characteristic that uh, it has now how has this actually helped me uh, develop a business now of course it's very muddy here so i'll find a way now how has this actually helped me develop a business now because uh, in the previous video i mentioned do not commit zina which is promiscuity and what does this mean because of course life has rules you know you can follow them or you may not it's up to you but if you do follow them then god will reward you now god didn't just say like oh you know if you pray to me you'll have everything yes that's part of it but you also have to be actionable now like i mentioned if you don't uh, commit promiscuity now what happens is that you know if you lose your virginity with a uh with your first with your first time you're more likely to succeed you know and it's the same thing so how have i applied this concept to to my life i've actually chosen one industry and i've kept at it for the past four years every single day without fail now there's many many people in this world that will try like oh you know what drop shipping didn't work or youtube didn't work uh selling this didn't work now there may be a uh, very very reasonable reasons as to why that didn't happen but a lot of the times what happens is you just give up too early you ask them like oh how long have you been doing this for oh you know two weeks yeah of course if you do it for two weeks nothing can happen you know so that's why this is how i apply this concept to to my life like i try to do one thing at a time not one thing at a time but i try to keep at it so the more i keep at it i actually uh see results you know like if i was to pray for like one or two weeks it wouldn't have worked out as well but because i kept at it for, for months and months and then i saw the actual benefit you know so that's why i do suggest everyone guys if you are uh, embarking on a journey uh, of of anything keep at it and especially if you do believe in it if you do believe in it a hundred percent you should keep at it and you shouldn't give up uh, yeah peace there was a point actually that i forgot to mention about running a business as well not just the point as to keeping at it but also if you're trying too many things at a time let's say you're trying like three businesses at a time it will be very very difficult to make uh, any significant difference if you're giving 50% 50 like if you're giving 33% 33% 33% to like drop shipping uh, youtube and another business uh, it will be very very difficult for you to succeed uh, but if you can give 100% of your devotion towards one thing you're more likely to succeed uh, and it's the same thing you know like if you're giving your time to like three women or if you're giving your time towards different avenues you know if you're trying too many things at once there's only so much mental space and capacity that you have to actually succeed so that's another thing uh, as to about the oneness of god you know one 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 that's the key you know keep at it like stick to one woman stick to uh one business stick to like just the things that you do believe in of course and this all comes with logic as well you know like i don't mean to like stick to just one thing that is bad for you of course but like do if you do see the long-term vision if you do believe in it then I, I i do suggest like don't give up in it and of course obstacles will come towards you you know especially if you're running a business and you're new you're trying to learn you're trying to get the gist of it but that's part of it you know and uh, every time you overcome it you become better so yeah that's another uh, point that i wanted to just let you guys know